I'm delighted to say we're joined now by Reza Madavi, who's the president of Ipanema. And, and Reza, what have you made of the conference so far? What have you seen that's interesting? Well, what I have seen is uh, clearly uh, a very much of the same direction that I've been seeing in Europe, uh, where most of the enterprise customers are looking to their service providers to give them uh, a level of value that is differentiated than what they have been doing in the past. They're always looking for more. So enterprise customers throughout the world are looking for a partnership with service providers that it can give them what they need in order for them to, to run their business effectively. So what are the things that they need to run their business effectively? Mm, good you question, ask. good question. I was about so, to, but you uh, carry I on. thought you were going to ask me that <laughs> question. So they are, they are really looking for a network that is capable, that is industrial strength, that it's smart, that it can actually differentiate between the types of applications that they're running, that it can actually guarantee the performance of their application no matter where you are or how you're getting access to that particular application. And as you know, there is this huge movement towards what is called cloud computing, which it means the idea that you do not have your application sitting in the same office as you as an end user. So your application is somewhere, uh, your data may be sitting somewhere else, over the cloud, in the network, somewhere in the globe. Your ability to be able to exchange and weave in these things together so that the end user will be able to get that at the point of a button is all about that. So we, that's, that's the trend and that's what, uh, uh, again, customers are looking for. So the, the service providers that are uh, eager to offer that level of service, they're going to fare extremely well. And how do you get that? How do you manage to do that, meet that demand? Uh, well, the good news about the cloud computing side, it's a trend that it started about a few, two years ago, roughly speaking, and it's building up. So customers, enterprise customers again, that are looking to take advantage of the benefit that it comes in from, uh, from uh, this level of cost savings that it comes with it. So they don't need to go and develop their own customizable CRN, for example, or their own customizable Salesforce forecasting tools, or even for that matter, voice or unified communication. You can have it without you actually owning it. So if you can have that, you need to then be able to provision substantial amount of uh, network requirement to benefit from that. And I think the good news is that it's the trend, so it's, 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 the, tr it's the, tra the train has left the station. Uh, usually the train leaves the station, I would say in US or in Europe. In this particular case, I would say it started in Europe as opposed to US. Um, so that's why most of our service provider partners that we have with Ipanema Technologies has been in Europe. Uh, US is beginning to catch up. And I have a feeling that the U.S. timing and the Middle East timing per perhaps could be this time very much alike and for them to be able to take advantage of that trend. And as a company, you're looking at this area quite heavily, aren't you? We are. In fact, we just launched our partnership here with SecureWay and uh, we are hoping to have the partner that can offer uh, that level of service and support that most of our service providers customers are looking for. So we are very uh, excited about this opportunity. I have done business here in the past. Uh, in fact, I spent 14 years in Europe uh, working with a different organization at the time to offer um, the kind of an infrastructure they were looking at. Now my job is to come in and bring that level of intelligence that you put on top of that network and make it smart enough so that the customers would benefit from it. So yes, this is our kind of a debut, as you say, in French, uh, which is our heritage in terms of the company. We are a European-based company. And like most companies that are US-based companies, and we're happy to, uh, to be here today and very happy to uh, interact with a number of executive, key executives from uh, uh, service provider organizations uh, throughout the region. How important is a conference like this for you then? This is an opportunity for us to kind of get together, network, uh, to tell them what we do. They tell us some of the issues and problems. I think without these, frankly, uh, the cost of uh, knowledge transfer becomes extremely uh, uh, difficult for many organizations. And I think at times like that, you really want to maximize it. So I have encouraged everyone of my organization and people that are here to really use their time effectively, network, hear the stories, hear what, uh, what it's working for some of the service providers and perhaps they can learn from it. And I think it's been very good event for me. I took a long trip to get here from Boston, but I'm happy to be here. 
Right, so that was fascinating. Thank you very much. Thank you. It was my pleasure. Okay, great. Cheers. Thank you.